Hi everyone, I wanted to show you guys how I packed my Kipling. This is the Sadie and it's in the color grape juice. I wanted to show you guys how I pack it for a one-year-old and a two-year-old. So this bag has a front zipper pocket here that is kind of hidden by this little flap here. But there's a zipper pocket here that runs along the bag. And then there's two zipper pockets here and then one little slip pocket there. And then the Sadie has the uh, two side pockets here. They're not bottle pockets, but I'm guessing maybe a sippy cup might fit there. I'm not sure. I haven't tried it. So there's one in each side. And then there's another pocket that runs along the bag. And this one has Velcro. And then there's the middle, the main compartment. So let me start with the outside of the bag. In this pocket here, I always have my camera with me. You know, the kids are probably doing something that I want to take a picture of, capture the moment. I have it with me all the time, right here. In this little pocket here, I usually don't put anything. Maybe if I have a receipt that I just want to, you know, tuck it in somewhere really fast, it'll go in there. And then in this zipper pocket here, I just have some random things. I have my lip balm. I have some lotion. I have some teething pills for my daughter. She is teething, so I like to carry that with me here. And then I just have some outwards. And I believe... Oh, and a little clip. And that's all I carry there. <laughs> and then in this zipper pocket here, I just have my sunglasses. I have my key fob with my keys hanging there and i have my banana wallet and this wallet is vivid purple this is grape juice and that's all i oh sorry and i have a pen and just a hair tie big hair thing for me and that's all i have in that pocket and this ring here you have a strap i actually just took it off today I was out with my daughter and I only needed these, so I kind of took the long strap off. But I usually carry it with me. I just have a Bubble Trouble Passy Pod. This is the Jujube with Tokidoki. And in this side pocket here, I have a Kipling Creativity Pouch. And here on the side, I kind this doesn't come with the pouch. Um, it came with my booty pod cover. I kind of attached it to here. It took the monkey off. This is kind of like my toiletry bag. So if I need to go, you know, to the restaurant with my with my son who is nine years old, or my two year old, um, or myself, I take this with me. And in this um, pouch, I have a little towel just in case you know if i go to the restroom my kids go to the restroom there's no towels to clean themselves i use this and then i have some toilet seat covers i have two of them here and then in this middle zipper pocket here i just have feminine products that i might need and i have some toothpicks some floss and that's all i carry in there and i kind of have it in the zipper pocket just in case you know i'm out with um, my sister or my brother or someone and they need something that's not you know a feminine product it's more private it's closed in there if i open it they could just see whatever's in this pocket it's not in the middle one and that's all i carry there and that's all that fits in this pocket and this other side pocket here i basically have two reusable shopping carts um, bags sorry and they are pretty slim so they fit perfectly in there and now in the back zipper pocket not zipper pocket sorry in this back pocket here i have that's my daughter making that noise sorry some boogie wipes and i also have a mesh shuttle the reason i have the mesh shuttle here and, and open with my wet ones is because I put it in here sometimes these leak so I like to have it somewhere where you know if it does leak it's gonna stay in here and it's not gonna get this wet or stain it or anything like that so I put it here and then if we if I do use you know a, a, a wipe I usually throw it in here if it's dirty 
or any trash that I might have, I just go ahead and throw it in, in here in the mesh shuttle so I don't have to get this dirty or wet or anything. And that's all I have in there. Now in the main zipper pocket here, give me one minute. That's it. Okay. In this zipper pocket here, this is how it basically looks inside. For you that have a uh, kitchen, the Sadie, you guys know that it has a pocket here. It has a middle pocket, a uh, pencil pocket or pen pocket there, and another pocket here. And then it has a zipper pocket in the back. So this is how I usually pack it when I'm going out with my two-year-old and my one-year-old. In the bottom of my bag, I have a 8 in an a swaddle blanket. In that blanket, I use it to nurse my daughter in public or she falls asleep in the stroller i have something to cover her with or you know if they spill something on them and they don't have a, a napkin or anything near me i could always use that and the reason i'm kind of telling you why i have it all the way in the bottom i wanted to show you that it's very easy to take out from the bottom you don't have to take everything on top to take it out obviously to put it in i just basically throw it on top i can't put it in with all this stuff inside I usually do that when I get home. So when I do take it out that I do need the swaddle blanket, I just kind of yank it out like that. And this is how I take it out. And then everything is still inside and organized. And that's I just wanted to show you how I had it down there. And after the I take everything out, I'll show you how I lay it flat. So on the top, I just have some random toys for my daughter. If you know we're out and she's kind of a little bit fuzzy i'll give her a toy and she'll mellow down and then in this zipper pocket in this little pocket here i just have a sippy cup holder you put this on the sippy cup and then you put it on your stroller or your cart or something and then if they do throw it it won't fall off and then sorry my daughter's helping me out and then in this little pocket here i also have a little quicklet an itty bitty i guess it's made by a lovely mama on the custom page she made this for me and i just have some um hair clips hair bows hair ties and a, and a brush in there for my one-year-old in this pocket here i have a small set piece the iconic and in here i just have my first aid kit and like other little random things so here in this little sippy bag i just have i kind of misplaced a while ago my pill box so now i put it here and then this is just a bottle opener sometimes we'll buy those apple juices or um those drinks that you need to pop up the you know the bottle i have that with me and i have some nail filers i just have some neosporin I have a little um, knife in there in case, you know, I, I buy something that needs to be open. That always helps out. And then I just have some bandages and I have a no uh, tweezer inside, a small one, just in case I need it. And then this pouch here, it's a Kipling pouch, I believe. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Ika, Ika, I, I mean, I don't know how you pronounce it, but it comes with three. And... I usually, this is the medium one, and in here I just have my son's change of clothes. He's two years old. So here I just have, to give you guys a quick glance, a pair of socks, some shorts, a pair of underwear, and a shirt. And it all fits in there perfectly, and it's not um, thick or, you know, it's very lightweight. So I like that. And if I just have my daughter with me, if I drop off my, my son at uh, pre-K, I'll just take this out and her toys will lay in there. And this is all we have when me and her go out. And then this little key fob here thing, I have a little iconic pouch. And here I just have my headset if I'm out and I want to be on my phone or somebody calls me and I'm driving, I have it with me in there. And then in this medium iconic set piece, is basically my snack bag. In here, I have just have a whole bunch of snacks in there. I have some for my one-year-old, my two-year-old, my nine-year-old, or even me. And it's just some random 
fruit snacks and I just discovered discover these not so long ago. They actually don't taste anything like vegetables. And my son's a very big eater, my two-year-old. He won't have any vegetables, but since this is candy, he'll eat it. And it's it, they taste pretty good. They don't taste bad. And I have several of those in here. I just have my spoon and fork here, a disposable change um, bib. Sorry, my daughter was getting fuzzy. And then here I just have a Jujubee Sippy Rocket. And I love the Sippy Rocket. And the fact, the reason that I love it, it's because these Kipling bags are not diaper bags. So they don't have insulated bo bottle pockets. And the side pockets are too small for some bigger, thicker Sippy, um, some Sippy Cups. Sorry. And here, this is insulated. And in here I have my daughter's sippy rocket i mean sippy cup sorry my i'm like tongue tied today here it as you can tell it's pretty it's pretty long and i just have this platex cup here and it comes with the you know the straw and i like it because it's here and it, if i want to keep it warm or cold it's in there and i'm not that worried that it, it's going to spill because it's kind of um contained in here i'm not sure if this is waterproof or if it'll you know contain the water inside but i like the fact that it could just be standing up and i could take this with me and that's that's all that i will need or if you know something's cold or hot i want to keep it in that temperature it'll be perfect in here and then in my bubble trouble quick it's pretty pretty packed as you can tell i basically have my this is my my daughter's changing quick I just have a patina pickle bottom changing pad. I have another mesh shuttle. I do cloth diapers, so I have a mesh shuttle in here. Just in case I change the diaper, I'll put the dirty one in here. And then I have my booty pot with the bubble trouble um, cover in it. I have a 12 month onesie, a pair of pants, and I have a Grovia diaper with a disposable inside. In this back zipper pocket here, I just have my daughter's uh, a pair of socks, and I just have an, a trash bag in there, and that's all that's in here. Oh, no, I'm lying. I have the Honest Company healing balm, and I also have the Honest Company. It's the samples that they give you when you first try, when you first join them, if you want to try their samples, and then a hand soap. In case the restroom where I go doesn't have, you know, hand soap, I have that with me. And on the bottom, all the way down here, I do have a wet bag. And this wet bag, I'm not sure of the company's name. But I carry it here because my son is two years old, but he'll have accidents here and there if we're up and about. And he... You know, we don't make it to the restroom. He'll have an accident. So I'll have his clothes in here. And the reason I like this bag in particular is because you could fold it. And it has a magnet there. So it has a zipper It has a zipper on top, but it also has a magnet. So I thought that was pretty neat. And it goes down there and it does not take up any room whatsoever. In the back here, in this zipper pocket here. I could open it. Here I just have this travel john. And what this is, I don't know if anybody is familiar with this, but this is basically if you're in a car and you know your kid car you know car sick or if like my two year old, this might sound nasty to some of you, but if my two year old if we're in the car and it's a long drive and there's no restrooms near us, this is perfect because this you just rip up this little piece up here you tear it and then you my son you know pees in there yes it sounds nasty i know but this has like little um it has like little i don't say rocks but like, like little things in there that absorb like the diapers like the disposable diapers it has it has those little things in here so it absorbs all the, the water or if they do throw up it absorbs it it deodorizes it so if you you know just put it on the side in your car after it's been used your car won't stink like urine or vomit it'll just be contained in there so when you get home you just toss it in the trash 
And like I said, this has been a lifesaver to us because we have used it with my two-year-old because we're out and he, unfortunately, we, there's no restroom near us. And that's all I have there. That's all I carry in my Sadie. And I hope you guys liked the video. I'm sorry it was a little bit too long and I, I was stuttering a little bit. It's just been one of those days. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.